Good morning, church. Pastor Caleb here with your devotion for this Tuesday. And today the passage is, for, is Proverbs chapter 3, verses 5 through 12. I will encourage you to go ahead and read that on your own. And uh, go ahead and pause the video right here. And uh, I'll wait for you to come back. Okay, finished? Good. Um, the The... Part of this passage that stuck out to me was the very first line, trust the Lord with all your heart, do not rely on your own insight. I think that is such a profound thing. Uh, first off, let me address what that is not. It, doesn't, it does not mean that we are to throw our brains out the window. It does not mean we are not to strive to know more. It does not mean that God doesn't want us to be intelligent and use the brains that God has given us. Instead, this means don't try and rely only on our own steam, only on our own wisdom, only on our own knowledge as it is now to accomplish what God is setting us out to do. Or just to even get through, you know, your every, everyday average uh, life. We need to remember this specifically and particularly as the church. Because in my time in the church, we have this tendency to try and do things ourselves and just work harder through things and try and come up with new ideas ourselves without seeking to be guided by God, without relying first on God, without praying for God's guidance and creativity and, and understanding that this is 100% God's activity. And we, without God, can do nothing. Oh, we can do stuff, we'll try and try and try and we'll end up failing. But if we listen to God and rely on God to do the things that we believe God is calling us to do, then, one, it's not as hard. And two, it's likely going to yield something that we would call success. That the thing that we set out to do might not end up in success, but we might get the, an idea for something else. God might be saying, no, you're not going that way, but at least you're moving. Go move this way, because what I want you to do is over here. Friends, especially in this time, I think it can be a temptation for a lot of us to overfunction, to try and make up for the fact that we don't really have much control over what's going on right now. But don't, do not rely on our efforts, our own understanding, but instead pray to God. What is God revealing to you in this time? In the midst of this horrible thing that's happening, what is God revealing to you? What is God moving you to do now or in the future? And try to see that in the light, in, in the midst of this, this very trying time. Let us pray. Loving God, we thank you for each and every day. Help us to lean on you, to seek your wisdom, your creativity, your love, your peace, always. May we, may we lean more on you than on our own works and our own understanding. In Jesus' holy name we pray. Amen. Thanks a lot, folks. I hope you found that very uh, helpful to your walk this day. We'll see you tomorrow.